single documentary, these are all extremely powerful and moving stories that have been lovingly crafted. So let's take a look at the nominees. Lucian Freud, Painted Life. But what inspired Lucian's devotion throughout his life? In most cases, it's the person he loved at the time. In 1948, that person was Kitty Garman, the daughter of the sculptor Jacob Epstein. He married her, and she became the subject of his first major series of portraits. 7-7, seven, seven, one day in London. As they were carrying me out of the tunnel on the stretcher, I remember after all that time in the dark, it seemed as if the station was just glowing with light. It was a very, very emotional moment for me. Backer, a cry from the rainforest. This morning we have to leave. Ali knows in his heart that Yeye will never be able to come back here again, but still he continues to encourage her. Nina Conti, a ventriloquist story, her master's voice. This feels silly, talking in an empty room in the middle of the night in Kentucky to an imaginary monkey. Yeah, you don't like it anymore. Don't you? You don't like it anymore? No, I don't like it anymore. goes to 77 one day in London um, thanks very much to BAFTA for this um, I'd like to say thank you to the BBC, to Charlotte Moore in particular, who gave us the, the, the time and space to make a, a measured uh, and restrained film about 7-7. Um, it's not often you get an opportunity to do that, and uh, we really appreciated that. Um, I'd like to thank everyone at Minnow Films for their support. Um, but most of all, we want to thank the people who show great courage and dignity in sharing their stories, helping both with the research and also with the filming. So thanks very much to them. Congratulations. I Thank see you all have you. one each. I didn't know if they gave like one to the group or if you got, but you've got one each. That's brilliant. So where do these go? Mantelpiece. Nice. <laughs> yeah. nice. Office. Yeah. Excellent. Good, good. Well, and um, there's certainly quite a, an amazing showpiece to have, but obviously a very deserved prize as well, um, because it was it was a fascinating um, documentary. And how how important is it to kind of talk with these contributors? And how much pressure do you feel that you have to live up to when you're working with them? Um, well, why don't you answer that, Sarah? Because a lot of that was <laughs> your pressure. Yeah, yeah it's a huge responsibility, and. Um, we're just enormously grateful that people were willing to talk to us about their experiences. Um, but it, it felt like a huge responsibility making this film, and it's one that we took really seriously. Well, this will mean a lot to them, this win, but also what will it mean to you guys? Well, I mean, it's, it means it does mean an enormous amount to us, but we hope that they, uh, that everybody who contributed to the film can, can share in that. But we also hope that it means that films like this that are quite challenging, um, it's a feature-length film, it's a, it's a 90-minute film, and not necessarily a, a, an easy film to commission, but we hope that more films like this get commissioned because they clearly resonate with an audience and um, it was an important film to make and there are other important films to be made, so we hope they continue to be made. Okay. Well, look, thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank Enjoy you. your evening. Thank you, thank you very much. Right. Thank you. Thank you.